There's just so many belts to choose from! Ah! What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Again, my name is Migs and I do belt reviews now in English. <laughs> Alright, so for today, I want to talk about what belt should you get? Because nowadays, there are just so many makers of championship belts. Unlike the simpler days where you can only get them from Figures Toy Company. Now, there are just so many makers out there. You have WWE Shop, Fandu Belts, Nawaz Belts, ELT Belts, Fight Night Belts, Classic Shields, Royal Belt, ORM Belt, and many more. Aside from that, you still have to think about what type of belt should you get. You have so many options, such as WWE Shop replica belts, commemorative belts, bootleg belts. This belt is from Fandu. This one is from Muhammad Nawaz. The old toy belts. The newer toy belts, which I don't really like. Signature series belts. Alright. 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 Wow. You also have to choose if you want belts made in the United States, made in Pakistan, or made in China. Our country doesn't make it yet. I'm sorry, Philippines. <laughs> For bootleg belts, you still have to decide. Do you want SD etching, HD etching, grade A SD etching, acid etching? What do you want? It's hard to decide! <laughs> The good news is, I'm gonna be giving you some advice which belt to get. This is all just based on my experience when I started collecting belts and I hope this helps you guys. Alright, number one. If you're a kid and you're not yet earning your own money and your parents want to give you a belt as a reward, as a gift, good grades, graduation celebration, the best advice that I can give is go for the WWE Shop commemorative belts or the adult size toy belts that you can get from Toys R Us. Why? The reason for that is, you're still growing up. Technically, these belts are not toys. These are collectible items and quite frankly, they're not cheap. And you're gonna be using your parents' hard-earned money for that. So, my advice is go for the toy belts because chances are you're gonna be using them to play with your friends and probably gonna do the stunts that WWE superstars are doing. Like what we do when we were kids. <laughs> If your parents are generous enough to offer you the replica metal ones, go for it. Just make sure that you don't bash your friend's face in. <laughs> Number two. I actually belong in this category. Adults who just want to relive their childhood memories. La 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 la. I'm a child again. Alright. 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 <laughs> Yeah. If you're an adult and you're planning to get belts just to relive your childhood, if you're just going to display it, go for the commemorative belts. It requires less maintenance because it's plastic, they're a good value for your money, and quite frankly, if you put a commemorative belt side by side with an adult replica zinc plated ones, you wouldn't be able to tell the difference anyway. But if you actually want metal belts like I do, I would recommend going for the WWE Shop Zinc Plates because with WWE Shop belts, there is always a level of quality that you can expect. And for the last one, number three. These are for the people who actually want the TV replica belts. And what I'm talking about is these belts are the closest things that you can get to the real TV used belts. I'm talking about belts with a WWF blocked logo, winged eagle belts that the sidebars are still attached, replica belts that has real leather like this, or belts that comes with covered screws at the back. Now, if you have the budget to really splurge on a belt, then go for Classic Shields. Everybody knows that Classic Shields makes one of the best belts in the industry. You can't go wrong with them. Their etching and their attention to detail is impeccable. Wow, big word. Impeccable. <laughs> but if you still want those things but can't quite afford Classic Shields, my recommendation is go for three belt makers. You can go for Nawaz, 
You can go for Nawaz, ELT belts, or Fight Night belts. Or if you want the big gold championship, you can go to FanDu, just like what I did. Alright, I hope this video helped you guys in deciding which belt to get because I've been there. <laughs> <laughs> I hope this video helped you guys. If you have questions, again, you can always leave it in the comments down below. If you also have suggestions on which belt to buy, you can also leave that in the comments down below. And I also want to get your opinion. Which belt would you go for? Alright, that's it for now guys. Thank you for staying until the end of the video. Again, if you like this video, please hit like. Also, subscribe for more content like this. I try to upload videos every Sunday in case you haven't noticed. So watch out for more videos. There are still a lot of videos I want to cover with you guys. Stay tuned. Once again, thank you for watching. Again, my name is Mix. If you haven't already, please watch my unboxing videos here, here, and here. And if you haven't already too, you can click my face right here. That's it for now guys. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Migs and I'll see you on my next video. Break break.